あれおいメイレちゃん I do like how originally they just dragged her off to the playground and we were just like eh, we'll keep an eye on her I guess <laughs> What? <laughs> Not about you children <laughs> I don't think I mean it might be actually <laughs> Kids are kind of dumb sometimes. Yeah, you do. Wow. I didn't abandon nobody. I was enlisted. I, but... She lives on my porch. I don't know what you want from me. Oh no. We'll do it. Don't think we won't. Oh, she's already like in that I'm not really wanted, obviously, kind of thing. I mean, Nether Dragon, anyway. Oh. Oh, she even told them. You might have gotten struck by lightning. Well, you're not cursed. I mean, I would hope not. <laughs> nah, kids, you're cursed forever. No, no, shut up, kid. You don't understand. Oh my god, they're gonna side with her all the time. Oh, there's a butt. Hold up. Never mind. They're on my side. What? Impossible. <laughs> yeah. S okay, okay, kids. You, 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 you're doing good for me. What are you about to say? And Suzuka thought she was gonna fucking die and tried to be all weird about it. ジボ<笑> You can't help but to. Listen, I try to get something out of it, okay? I like the sometimes. It's not every time. Hey, that's an even trade. <laughs> Shut your damn mouth, kids. I don't believe that, that's to be fair, you're probably more well off than he is. <laughs> He's bumming off children. Uh, the kid's actually gonna get through to her heart. Come, come on. You can do, you can forgive, whatever. I come on. Yay! She didn't promise nothing. She just said, Oh, he's been there the whole time. Hmm. I escaped from the festival preparations only to end up eavesdropping on the conversation. Half of that was quite insulting and half was complimentary. That said, it was all largely true, including the bit where I help out for food. That's the most important part. You don't understand. 
That aside, what caught my attention the most was how May looked so miserable. Don't tell me. She can't fix me? Nobody can. In which case, the person suffering the most right now would be... Oh, God. <laughs> She's hunched over, walking at what can only be described as a trudge. <laughs> uh, hey, May. <laughs> Scared the crap out of her. I catch up with her and tap her on the shoulder, at which point her tail goes uh, bolt upright in fear. Can you stop with the thing? Stop being so stiff. Yeah, see? Come on. Gotta be cautious. At least that's what I thought until now. I escaped. I ran away. Yeah, they're usually angry with me for one reason or another. And if the way she's acting is a result of her guilt, then I need to take a different approach with her. Of course. I'm not worried about that. I pat her head. Oh my god, he's, 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 he's like reaching. She's like a chihuahua. Like, she's just all bark and really no bite until she curses me. <laughs> Naturally, she bats my hand away. Ow. <laughs> and so, later on in the story, she falls. <laughs> and that's what? 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 May? Where are you? What? What? She just disappeared around the corner without giving me time to even try and stop her. That was far faster than any human could move. Oh no. No. Ah, that's why May fled. Dude, the one second she was gone. Hey, I thought I wanted to check out the open fries. Don't you worry. Did I say fries? You know what? I could go for some fries right about now. Fires. Don't you worry about me. I'll. I'm in. Wait, what? Hurry up. Let's get moving. <laughs> Every fucking time, dude. I make to start walking off before coming to a halt. Soba's pretty tasty. Wink. Not gonna pop her head around the corner, huh? That definitely would have hooked Haru. I know that for a fact. That's because Haru is... She loves food so much. <laughs> it's tough. It's like trying to, like, uh, get a dog to trust you that's been, like, hurt so much. You know what I mean? Oh, Now I'm sad. God damn it. Oh, why do I do this to myself? Why do I exist? Oh. Okay, are you like perched over us, like straddling us and looking over us, or what are we doing? Uh. Oh, and oh, did I just feel a little gust of gloom off thing on the front from the porch? <laughs> she didn't have to run away. You'd think she was a stray cat. Then again, at least a stray cat would open up to you if you gave it some food. No such luck with May. That's true. That didn't even work. It's even festival day. Oh, shit. I don't care about the festival. Not personally. Actually, she, there's no way she could have been on top of us. She's just looking at us. Because Haru's on top of us, like, all the time when she's sleeping. You see? <laughs> Haru nestles herself on my stomach, showing no signs of getting up soon. What, what, what are you doing today? Helping out next door? <laughs> That's not... Iris said she was helping out with shrines in the bond dance, right? Ooh. As for me... Somehow feels like my plans and goals are all coming together here at the festival. The tip-top priority is... Eh, it's no use. I can't go back to sleep. <laughs> I might need to. No, I'm not going anywhere. Go on, go back to sleep. Go on, get. 
Why did I say go on get? No, go back to sleep. The festival doesn't really get fully underway until the afternoon anyway. By then, the stalls will all be up, and they'll be parading the portable shrines through the streets. Uh, say, did they tell you, did, 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 did Suzuka tell you what she'll be up to today? Oh. <laughs> Don't fucking scare me like that. Ah! <laughs> I can see her panties. I, I mean, as usual, they are quite gaudy. I've seen to them, and they are fantastic. <laughs> grind, grind. Don't step on my face. Stop. You only empower me further. Heh. <laughs> If I have to. He gave you a if I have to. That's more than he usually does. <laughs> she, she even knows. Oh. <laughs> Mother of God. I don't deserve those shocked looks from the both of you. Haru says, the apocalypse is upon us. Absolutely hilarious. I won't be doing any lazing around now that Suzuka's here, so I push off my blanket substitute. That's Haru. Eight in the morning, huh? Ew. Ugh. Want me to help you set up? I'll do it for a thousand yen. That's ten bucks. That's a steal. <laughs> you know I had to break into my emergency savings to fix the plumbing, right? I have nothing. <laughs> Usually I manage to make do regardless of how broke I am. But the festival's a costly thing. Oh, it's so costly. If you're gonna invite someone to one, then you need to be prepared to at least pay for the minimum. Ah, uh, I see where he's going with this. We gonna get May up in here? May, come on. <laughs> Alrighty, that should do it. Damn, look at all this. We got shaved ice and sweet dumplings. Per for the perfect sweet stall for a summer festive evitable. <laughs> You like them burnt, huh, Haru? She getting the whole thing, dude. <laughs> 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 Who, what? Who, what? Does what? Well, I raised her. For real? Doesn't sound like me. So <laughs> now. Now that you mention it, I do recall or seem to recall Akino giving me dumplings and taking us balloon fishing. Ooh, the balloon fishing. Ah, oh, yeah, that's quite a memory right there. So that's why the stall gave me a sense of deja vu. <laughs> He's like I had almost forgotten all those years ago. Oh, it's you, the uh. Butcher's son? What are you guys selling today? Kebab. Oh my god, yes. What's a kebab? I'll trade one for a dumpling. <laughs> yes, ma'am. She's gonna be my ass one day. What? <laughs> <laughs> Fucking Suzuka. Tug tug. She's left. So. <laughs> <laughs> it was like a, and he's gone. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> she knows what I'm getting at. She knows. Yeah, Suzuka. You're not old enough yet. <laughs> Says the fucking... ...もやっとしないわけでもないですが... <laughs> Okay, she's acting real high and mighty for first wife. That's why. Uh, Technically, Suzuka's first wife. 
then Haru, then uh, Iris, I would say, then Song. No, Song would probably third wife, to be honest. Then Iris, and oh god, there's so many wives. I ended up doing some odd jobs and having to talk to people after lunch. Ew, talking. Once again, I've come to the conclusion that hard work doesn't pay, but that's not relevant right now. <sighs> Now's probably a good time. It must be around 3 p.m. There are a lot of people around now, many of them wearing yukata. It very much feels like your stereotypical festival now. Oh. Oh. oh, look at what she's wearing. The stall is up and running with like a bunch of ends and, well, an extra end. Meaning I have nothing left to do. Guess I should get going. Better be sneaky about it, just in case. Just slide away. Sli slink away, boys. Slink away. Fuck. <laughs> it's like trying to decipher his actions. Oh, shit. She looks really good in this, by the way. Uh... Really, she looks good in anything. Uh, no matter how far I get from the station, I can still hear the festival music. I pass by countless people dressed for the occasion on my way here. Ah, <sighs> right then. Okay, I think it's this way. Oh, ooh. So, oh, hey, see? Look, 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 look. I knew she'd be here. Oh. <laughs> it's the human. I think I'm able to tell where you are because the whole assimilation thing. Oh, I can sense her presence. <laughs> oh, come on. You must. All I had to do was wonder where could May be, and my legs just carried me here. I mean, I pat her on the head. <laughs> she just gets more cutely angry. If you insist. At some point, I started to feel an immense desire to protect this female. <laughs> Though she'd probably call me a puny human or something if I told her that. <laughs> protect. We protect. I was worried the kids would have beaten me to the punch, but it doesn't look like you have plans. Amigo. Yes? I came to ask you to go to the festival with me. Yeah. Well, shit. <laughs> It'll be fun. Well, you could know if you just went to the festival with us. That's all the more reason to join me then. And how many times do I have to be stubborn? Oh, that's what... That's what she's been doing this whole time? Ah, so you've been trying, huh? Oh, she's been trying to lift the curse every morning. That's what she's been doing. No wonder she, what she say last time? She was like, it's no good or whatever. Pet, pet. <laughs> hey now, forget about your troubles and come and have some fun. That's what festive inevitables are for. If she doesn't agree to do this, I'll never forgive myself for actually doing work to earn money. True. I'll get you something to eat. Something you like. Two things even. Hell, if they're cheap enough, maybe three things. Whoa. <sighs> three things, he says. All I want is to get along with you. Like I do with Haru, Iris, and Sango. <laughs> I'd like it if you could be friends with them, too. You might have to work extra hard on Iris, though. She seems to be very aggressive. <laughs> I mean, you came all the way to Earth, yeah? It'd be a waste not to enjoy yourself. So? Eh, wouldn't be the craziest thing to happen to me. It's fine. I mean, I'm fine. <laughs> Nothing bad has happened lately. I mean, you never know. Could just be that that trick to lifting the curse is becoming your friend. Oh my god, the true power of friendship and love and magic. It, that's how it works in anime. We won't know unless we try. And hell, even if it doesn't work, having things stay as they are isn't all that bad. 
So come on, be my friend. <laughs> Whoa! As she snorts dismissively, but I decide to take her hand before she has a chance to completely blow me off. <laughs> she knows. Not a word, but it'll be fine. She knows. She's not dumb. She's only dumb sometimes. Because I trust her. Haru's a kind girl at the end of the day. Come on already. Let's get going. <laughs> Just dragging her along. Oh my god, no. They have their own little stall. <laughs> A hundred bucks to take pictures with Dorami? Fuck that, dude. That's a little too much. <laughs> I'm more surprised they're getting sales. Wait, what? いっぺんに話しかけてくるのクズだ。何？あそこにいるのは。ない宮本。さあ。仮にも教祖の職責にあるものが私の許しもなく蝶々をしてるの。ワイドファックワイドニードパーミッション。どうせ暇だし、アホ
種族の記憶が教えてくれるお祭りは穀物がいっぱい取れた時とか結婚とか何かおめでたいことを喜び合うもの The damn collective memories added again. You're not entirely off base. Yorokobino wa mitai na mono. Yoni wa sona no enga nai mono da to omote da. Well, see, and nothing bad is even happening. That's just something you made up. You fit in here just fine. s h i t e n I don't see anyone being bothered by us here. Though they sure as hell are looking at us. It's a dragon. Of course they're gonna look. People around here are used to seeing dragons thanks to Haru and Iris, but this is a special dragon. I mean, a different dragon. Like, only two of her own race. <laughs> They may have wormed their way into helping with this festival, but to me, it feels like that's gone well. I did a good job making them fit for human society. That's my story, and I'm sticking to it. Ha ha ha. Maybe now we need to work on us being fit for human society. I think it was Iris who said that this festival was to celebrate this summer being the one where the dragons came to Earth. Though she said it in her usual cocky manner, mind you. As luck would have it, I just happened to catch sight of some paper lanterns. <gasps> Look over there. Those are the paper lanterns the girls made. Oh, and it's got the dragon on it. Dragon. Yeah, we, we seen to the Haru one. Yeah, hand drawn ones. The drawings aren't particularly good, but they have a certain charm to them. It would be nice if you could have joined them. Yeah. Tug tug? Oh, you need the bathroom? I, I was? Well, I'm pretty happy. The girls are becoming a proper part of society. Actually, that's not the reason I feel this way. I'm just glad that they're enjoying themselves. So I've been thinking it'd be nice if you could join their little group. Here we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Make friend. Why not? Well, the wimpiest of dragons would, of course, be scared. Don't worry, that wimpy dragon's terrified of Haru and Iris, too. Yup! I mean, look at us. She really believes that's true, doesn't she? Come on, it's a festival. You can't be getting all gloomy. I. Uh, what should I do here? Yakisoba is a festival staple, so that might work. It's expensive, though. Oh, God. We could probably get some free shaved ice or dumplings. <laughs> <laughs> Haru Haru's probably there, yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah, we're gonna just get some, gonna snag some. Although, there's a large chance that an angry Akino or Suzuka will be waiting for us since I ran away and all. Is that a risk I'm willing to take? Perhaps. <laughs> I, I don't want. Uh, how'd you arrive at that conclusion? I was just worried about my wallet. Yeah. <laughs> I'm telling you, you got the wrong idea. May stands out at the best of times, and I can tell that our argument is disturbing the peace of the festival and attracting more attention. <laughs> Listen here. We're going for shaved ice, and that's final. <laughs> It'll at least be warmer than the cold looks I'm getting here. <laughs> I'm not forcing anything, but I'm not. Oh my god, she is so difficult. What the fuck? Who's using all the power? What just happened? All the festival's electricity just. Wait, it's not just the electricity. What the fuck happened? Exactly. Oh. May is still trying to get free from my hand, but I reaffirm my grip. Power outage, huh? Talk about unlucky. I try to act as unconcerned as possible. I 
Oh, the bad luck, the curse. She's such a sad girl. Don't cry. Oh. No, it's not. Stop. Stop with the everything and the even so. <laughs> if anyone dares blame this girl for what happened while she's crying with guilt, I'll beat him up. What's so wrong with May enjoying her time at a festival, huh? Who cares if it's your fault? So you put some people out a little. It's no big deal. You can't spend your entire life worrying about every little time you can inconvenience someone else. <laughs> You're goddamn right I don't. Who is that? I like how Haru just found them. Whoa. Oh my god. Oh, help! Oh my god. <laughs> What's going on up there? Ha! The people all around us laugh as they look up at the sky. Look at the sky, May! Did she do like she. A large beaming lantern of sorts in the shape of Haru's face floats into the sky and remains hanging above us. It smiles down at all of us attending the festival. Now it's bright again. We can go back to having fun without worry. <laughs> sure, you do. Haru's helping us out. Look at that. She's doing this for you, May. It's like, I don't, I don't understand. Well, that's what I think. But, you know, even if Haru hadn't decided to help us, we humans aren't that pathetic. We really don't know when to give up. That's fucking true. No sooner have I said this than lights begin to flicker on and off like the hash-slinging slasher at the nearby stalls. Wonder if they're battery-powered. Oh, hey, even the music started back up. Oh, look at her. She's so happy. See, it was no big deal. You'll find that we humans are pretty incredible. <laughs> uh, true, we have we got impudence in spades, too. <laughs> yes. Iris, please, just settle. Calm down. No, stop. I mean, yes, but stop. <laughs> of course she doesn't. <laughs> oh, oh, God. And she's accosted on both sides. Oh, makes sense that Sango would be with Iris. You bought Takiyaki? Nice, give me one. Ah. Uh, oh, oh, God. Oh, it's hot. My mouth. <laughs> yeah, May audibly gulps as Sango, completely unfazed, ferries a piece of Takiyaki to her. Oh, yeah. Oh, God. We, I'm sorry, but I don't care if something is blistering ass hot. I'm going to eat it. Like, I'm, I'm not waiting for it to cool down. I'm a hungry boy. Hot, right? Why? <laughs> I don't care if my mouth gets blisters and my tongue is burnt. It's... <laughs> uh, I saw it. Cool if you're a five-year-old baby. I'll, it'll be out again tomorrow, right? I'll see it then. True, she was dragged here by me, specifically. Well, I guess I can't expect her to change completely just yet. Oh dear. <laughs> the group's back together again. Looks like the time's come. You can do this, May. And I will leave. Oh, there he goes. Oh, never mind. 
It's uh now we get to see this. <laughs> Jesus Christ, don't do the nay nay death's the only way out. Okay, good. No. <laughs> he has that effect on dragons. I was like, yeah, like a certain somebody who's fucking talking right now. Oh shit, wait. Oh, okay. So it really is the power of friendship. We fucking did it, dude. So be happy, be in a good mood, or I'll pound you. Haru, out. <laughs> no. Oh. Oh, she's back. Just you? Where's Haru? Okay, right. So, why does she seem so nervous? <laughs> sure thing. <laughs> this is normal. They've already started talk, uh, taking things down for the day, though, so there won't be all that much for us to do. Just, she just took me by the hand. Whoa. <laughs> Even he's like, hey, that for real? Well then, the curse may as well already be lifted. I... I would be inclined to agree. But we're already friends, right? Whoa. She tugs on my hand and yet for some reason also averts her gaze. May? Tug, 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 tug. Jesus Christ, we're escalating so fast. These dragons really don't fuck around. Wait, since when? But, well, I mean, if you're cool with it, then I am. Oh, damn. The way she's pushing her lips out toward me is so adorable that it instantly erases any hesitation I might have had. Here I go. Yeah, dude, these dragons, man, they they just, if, when they want, they want in. This is definitely taking us further down the path of friendship. We're gonna be way... Okay, we're getting past that point. I wasn't expecting her to come back for seconds. Now it's thirds. Uh-huh. Yeah, you did say you've been watching us the whole time. Wait, that means. Oh, dear. <laughs> you just skipped a whole hell of a lot of steps there. Dragons tend to do that, apparently. May's extremely nervous right now. There's no way she could have would have come out with this without considering Haru's opinion. What's her angle? Fucking <laughs> watch your angle. I wasn't going to. 